everyone. For sequence a sub n, our first term is 1, and 2 times a sub n plus 1 equals a sub 1, a sub n plus negative 1 to the power of n plus 1. And this is for n is uh, greater than or equal to 1. So our number of terms are uh, at least 1 and uh, bigger. So we're going to find the rule for the nth term of the sequence, a sub n plus 1 plus a sub n. The, our goal is to get this sequence here. So that we're going to do that by manipulating our equation. So let's write out what we're ha we have here. This is going to be 2 a sub n plus 1 equals a sub n plus negative 1 to the power of n plus 1. Now let's look at where we have n minus 1. So if we have n minus 1 and substitute that in here, we're going to call this equation 1. And if I substitute in n minus 1, I'm going to get uh, 2 a sub n equals a sub n minus 1 plus negative 1 to the power of n. Again, we're just trying to manipulate everything so we can get this. I'll call this equation 2. Now what I want to do is add these two together. So on the left hand side, I'm going to have 2 times a sub n plus 1 plus a sub n. See where I'm, where I'm coming from here. Now I have this. Um, on the right hand side, I'm going to have a sub n plus a sub n minus 1. All right, so um, also, let's see. If I solve for this, this is going to be a sub n plus 1 plus a sub n equals 1 half times a sub n plus a sub n minus 1. So now that we have solved for that, let's look at uh, equation 1 real quick. So for equation 1, when n is 1, we're going to get uh, 2 a sub 2 equals a sub 1 plus negative 1, and then substitute in your 1, 1 plus 1. This is going to give me 1 plus 1 equals uh, 2. All right, so we have 2 a sub 2 equals 2. If you divide both sides by 2, you get a sub 2 equals 1. So that's your second term. And then let's go on, and I'm going to go ahead and put it on this side. So basically, if you add a sub 1 plus a sub 2, a sub 1 is 1. So you're going to get 1 plus 1 equals 2. And this is going to be uh, 4. We'll call this 4. Now, by 3 and 4... So by, um, where's my 3? Here's my 3. There's my 3. So by 3 and 4, that means we have a geometric uh, sequence with our first term is going to be uh, 2, and our common ratio is right here is 1 half. All right. So basically, again, we have a geometric uh, sequence in a sub n plus 1 plus a sub n. Uh, our first term for this sequence here is going to equal 2, and the common ratio is 1 half. So we're going to use this formula here and write this as the nth term. It's going to be 2 times uh, 1 half to the power of n minus 1. And this is going to give you uh, 2 times um, 2, if I uh, change this to uh, 2 to the negative 1 power, so it's going to be 2 to the power of 1 minus n. And this gives you 2 to the power of 2 minus n, because that's going to be 2 to the power of 1. So you have 2, 1, plus 1, minus n. And this is your nth term. 
Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.